Name my legion. Uh, back when I was doing uh, the videos for the fair, you know, I stretched them out over a week. I did uh, one video called, uh, I believe the title is Shopping for Barbecue Sauce and Wing Sauce at Shady, uh, Shady Land Pellet Grills, I think it's called. And I bought like three types. I bought two barbecue sauce and a wing sauce. And I was waiting for my one uh, thing of barbecue sauce I have right now with that uh, craft garlic one, onion and garlic, I think it was, to be gone so I could try this one. This is one of the ones I bought. It's Green Mountain Grills Cherry Chipotle Barbecue Sauce. And in Chipotle, pepper wise, I have to try it. I'm a chili head. And Chipotle, for people who don't know, is the smoked jalapeno. I just give it a fancy name, but you know, it's cool. Chipotle is pretty good. It's a good smoky flavor and stuff like that. It's good with barbecue sauce. Should be good with a barbecue sauce. And uh, this is from GMG Green Mountain Grills. It was so weird because I thought the, I keep thinking the place that I shopped from, that I bought the things from at the fair, that tent was Green Mountain Grills because it says Green Mountain Grills right here, but Shady Land Pellet Grills, I think. And like I said, that one girl who owned the place with the arm and a cast she was cool enough to say hi to youtube and stuff like that on my video which is awesome you know so i mean you know so many chicken chicken shits don't want to say hi on youtube and stuff like that i got her to say hi but two girls on that support your uh northwestern uh volleyball said hi and that one uh cool lady who was the boss at the uh, country fair for that uh pumpkin pretzel thing said hi in the video so that's cool well anyways this is uh Cherry Chipotle, Green Mountain Grills, Barbecue Sauce. Uh, nutritional facts is there's like 30 per container, 12, and it's 40 calories per serving. Really small. It's hard to read, but vitamin C is 2%, iron 2%, calcium 2%. And the ingredients are ketchup, curry, I think curry, cherry, one minute, ketchup, cherry puree, puree. Cider vinegar, molasses, soy sauce, made from soy and wheat. It's called shu shuyu. S S H O Y U shuyu. I guess that's what it's called. Chipotle powder, garlic granules, chili powder, black pepper, allspice and spices. This product is produced by Green Mountain Grills LLC, made in the USA. It doesn't say where though. And it says good enough to drink, right here. Well, before I try our food, I'm going to see if it is good enough to drink. Open this up. And then sometimes it's the toughest thing. That you got this. Well, that's not too bad. A plastic shrink wrapped on there. Tear it all the way down. Shake up a little bit. You open it up. Has that little tap on it. Nah. Thanks. Of course, it didn't come off all the way. I hate it when it does that. Damn it. It's probably like a cherry pepper thing. Well, that's the best I can get it off. Put this down here. I'm like a tremendous mess. Oh. Alright. It smells like a cherry ketchup type thing. You know, I tell you, it says good enough to drink, so. Mm, that's very good, very smooth. Basically, it tastes like chili peppers, uh, cherry, uh, with chili peppers in the sauce, it's not bad at all. And it's pretty good because I had, uh, so I didn't buy any last year. And they had them last year. And the year before, they had buy one, get one free, and it was six fifty. These were $7 a piece. You know, if they were buy one, get one free, it would have been even better. But, you know. But uh, two years ago, I had, like, an Asian one, which was delicious. I mean, you really could drink that. It's like this one. And also, uh, Cattle drive, and I didn't think that was that good. Well, anyways, this is pretty good. It, it gets a good, probably there is some heat to it. It has like a little bit of a cherry taste to it with the peppers. Let's see what it tastes like. I have a little bit of the my sausage left. 
from earlier today. Put some a little bit on here. It's gonna taste like on here. I don't know. Try not to make a giant mess. All right. Another thing I'll be eating by myself. My dad hates barbecue sauce. He hates anything barbecued. You know, that's insane. Anyways, let's try this. Okay. Yeah, it's really good. You taste more of the sweetness of the cherry and a little bit of the heat. It's a little bit more like a sweet heat, which is you know, really the most popular thing in bar, bar and hot sauce right now, sweet heat. And then there's a lot more sweet than there is heat to this, but it's pretty good. I like it. And uh, let's try it. Mm. It has a really good light barbecue sauce. Somehow they have the heavy ones. That's pretty light. I like it. I mean, it's not Bullseye and Jack Daniels barbecue sauce are probably the best, but this is pretty good though. And it's especially one for seven bucks, and that's kind of pricey. But it's a twelve fluid ounce bottle because I spent, I think, the most I've ever spent on. Uh, I bought like specialty hot sauce before, and I think the most I spent like thirteen dollars for Frostbite. Which is a crystal clear hot sauce that celebrities use to put in the uh, in the soda pop, or like a Pepsi or something like that to make it hot. Some people said that's the appetite, but I really kind of liked it. Or you can put it on regular food too, but it doesn't have a taste, just that heat. This uh, has lots of flavor and stuff, but it's more sweet than hot. But it's pretty good. So, I mean, it's a specialty item. <clears throat> if you can find Green Mountain Grills, I check out their Asian, uh, man, like Asian plum. So I can't remember what it's called. I have to, I have an old, well, I have an Albion Fair movie that I did two years ago. Well, yeah, a little more than two years ago. That's an hour long. I split into four parts. And if I get a chance, if I still have it, I have the whole hour thing put together. I might put that just as one video on there. That'll be my longest video, probably almost a whole hour. And um, it shows you the barbecue sauce, that the Asian one I said I bought. But, like, this cherry chipotle is pretty good. I like it. I highly recommend it, though. Well, I give it a 9 out of 10. It's pretty good. And, like I said, the other barbecue sauce I got was a Tennessee Sour Mash. Whenever I use this up, I'm going to review that. And then uh, my wing sauce is all gone. And I have the wing sauce I bought there called Mumbo Wings. I don't think that's going to be hot, but... It should be pretty good. I hope it's good. And I'll probably review that Friday. And I'm going to do a review of, uh, if all things work out, you know, I it, it's all depends on what happens Friday. If something bad happens, I won't be able to do it. But, you know, I've been doing those things about support the Cranville Fire Department. I'm starting, to, I was getting the boneless wings. Now I'm going to start getting the, the bone-in wings because I think they're better. I'm going to get those. I'm going to do a review of that with that sauce. So that would be something to look forward to on Friday. So I hope you like this video. And please, uh, like I said, if you can, check it out, you know. So please, highly recommend it. Please like, please share, please subscribe. And until next time, take care of my legion. And uh, that's about it. One thing I wanted to say, when I did that thing about my thoughts about the government shutdown, one thing I forgot to say is uh, whenever the corrupt politicians, well, all the decent people, the government workers, getting laid off, they're decent working people, you know. They don't get a paycheck, but the corrupt and childish politicians get a paycheck. The one thing I said, they don't have nothing to lose. They do have something to lose. They're respected the American people, and they lost it a long time ago, you know. That's why I wanted to say, I forgot to say that in my thoughts on the government shutdown so now I'm done but until next time take care of my legion now hopefully this shut off now oh I don't know if it shut off or not